Hey guys, it's Jenny with Pratt Family Homestead. Tonight we are having sesame chicken made in the air fryer. I've only done this recipe one other time, but we really enjoyed it. And so I want to show you how it is that we make it. And I'm gonna cube up my chicken into bite-sized pieces. I'm doing a total of three chicken breasts. These are um, from our meat chickens that we raised this last fall. Okay, so now I'm going to mix in two tablespoons of cornstarch with our chicken and just give it a good stir around to coat the chicken before putting it in the air fryer. I have the air fryer warming up 380 degrees. That looks pretty good. So I'm just placing these in here in a single layer with some space around them so air can get all the way around. It takes a little bit longer, but that's all right. In each batch, I'm going to cook for about 14 minutes. Now that I'm on my third batch, my air fryer is really hot, and so I've reduced the time down to about 10 minutes. Halfway through, I'm going ahead and flipping them around, kind of giving it a good shake, making sure that they're not sticking. All right, so there's the chicken. It's nice and crispy, as you can see. Now it's time to make our sauce. For your sauce, you're gonna need one teaspoon sesame oil, quarter cup ketchup, quarter cup rice vinegar. It calls for a quarter cup soy sauce and a quarter cup hoisin sauce. I don't have hoisin sauce at the moment, so I'm doing half cup soy sauce. Two teaspoons of minced garlic. I don't have fresh garlic, so I'm just using ground. Six unpacked teaspoons brown sugar. Four garlic cloves minced. And then you need a cornstarch slurry, two teaspoons cornstarch, two teaspoons water. So we're gonna set that aside and you need sesame seeds for topping. We're gonna take the rest of these items and we're gonna mix it together in the saucepan. So I have it combined on the stove. I'm going to heat this up for about two minutes. I'm gonna add in my cornstarch slurry, help thicken it, bring it to a boil, let it boil for about three minutes, and then we'll combine it with our chicken. All right, in goes the slurry. Ooh, that's already thickening up. Got my chicken, my sauce is done, doing its thing. So we're going to pour it all over the chicken. Gotta get every bit of goodness. Take all those sesame seeds. Bam, bam, look at that. Does it look good? That looks amazing. <laughs> 